Ladies and gentlemen, hey, how are you? Good morning. Um, sorry. Yeah, it's one of the craziest things I have ever seen while doing door news. And it looks like a dragon. Super duper happy resurrection day to everybody out there. Yeah, that definitely looks like a dragon. And the thing that really made me take note of this thing was I was watching the rain on the West Coast go towards the West, which is not a feature we see a lot on here where the moisture is being pulled back over Nevada and California. I guess back out in the ocean for a whole nother dipsy do spin around but it definitely looks like a quetzalcoatl storm on easter eight days before the total solar eclipse that's going right over here or if we look at the projected monday coast to coast storm that's coming you've got a storm that's over 2500 miles that spreads coast to coast to coast So a lot to watch. And look at this. It, it look like animals. Or whatever. See, there's the beak. And there's the beak. But that's it. Today, the severe weather. Is that a pill or a banana? Do they have banana pills? So I was checking out the radar over here. And this one I saw the water vapor being pulled back in and over. Which most storms travel from west to east. And they just push on through. Anytime shit starts to rotate, I'm like, what? And then remember when Harvey, which happened pretty much during the eclipse, solar over the USA in 2017, Harvey just kind of spun like that. I'm not saying anything is going to Harvey. I am saying now is a great time to be watching the weather. If you enjoy the weather or just like to stay cool and play defense, stay weather woke. Because the, the thing that made me pay attention to like California and be like, hey, let me check out the storm was the 101 in California, Montecito, to be specific. Um, I've seen some footage come out of, yeah, there's some pretty nasty flooding happening in California. If you flood the 101, uh, that's a that's a definitely a major highway. That's a major city highway. So, and that storm is going backwards. And even as I have this up, I'm pretty sure this is a severe weather watch. It's probably just been added to the coast. So you've got this moisture circle being pulled around and this rain's coming back down. And then you've got a lot of rain down here. It's kind of stationary. So yeah, oh, shit's weird across the board and probably will be for let's just go ahead and say all of April perfect I'm here nerding out with you helping you stay aware the weather while those little cells are cool there's so much about our atmosphere and our planet we don't understand God is great happy Easter I don't know if you know this, 2017, around the same time as the total solar eclipse and Hurricane Harvey, there were also X-Class flares. And this has been a 2X-Class flare week for sure. Personally, I think the sun is a great metaphor for Jesus. Because there's darkness, and then the sun rises, and there's light again. And in many ways, there was always light up on the moon except when it's new one thing is interesting is there's a chance we've dropped down to uh three sunspots and that these two are about to turn off but i guess this one's back but it's a pretty low sunspot for the moment but the sun has just expelled and expended a lot of energy why is it called devil coming don't even look like a devil no more and it didn't before. I just thought it looked like a Millennium Falcon. She probably knew that. And that's the 
first time you've ever watched Thor News video. That probably doesn't make a lot of sense. Yeah, it's definitely worth watching. See, there's like its face, its neck, and its back, and its wings, and its tail. I guess it's rolling a ball. And then that would be its bigger body wings. And drawn dragons with clouds. People been doing that for a long time. Stay cool. And happy Resurrection Day. May you have a fantastic Super Sunday. God bless everyone. And may peace reign on earth. Thank you, Jesus. And kind of technically, me personally, it really starts to be Easter when the sun rises that day. Ooh, did you see that? See, that was something. We're just tuning in to the old SDO, checking out the two comet imprints. Comet Atlas and Comet 12P Prawns Brooks. And then you got another big coronal line there. Maybe that's the center of the galaxy. There it was. That was definitely something. There's something happening here. Stay cool.